thousand dead fetuses found in a Thai temple. This was a case that happened in November 2010. Thai police say they have found the remains of more than 2,000 fetuses thought to be from illegal abortions hidden at a temple in Bangkok. The remains were discovered in the temple's mortuary in containers usually used for bodies awaiting cremation. Police were alerted by a terrible smell after the temple's furnace broke down. Two temple workers and a woman believed to have been paid to collect and dispose of fetuses from illegal abortion clinics have been arrested. The bodies, wrapped in plastic bags, were discovered in a newly opened area of the mortuary. A 33-year-old woman has admitted to taking money to collect fetuses from several clinics. She earned just over $16 for each fetus she delivered to the temple. Police said two temple workers have been charged with hiding the bodies. Chan Amanas admitted to transporting bodies for the abortion clinics and said a doctor at one of the three sites taught her how to perform abortions. She told authorities that she had been hired by a number of clinics to transport the fetuses and had been doing so for the last five years. The clinics paid her $17 per trip, she said. She began performing abortions after the doctor she worked with moved to another clinic. She charged patients $167 if they were up to 3 months pregnant and $1,000 if they were up to 5 months pregnant. During Saturday's ceremony, the 2002 fetuses were ceremoniously given names written on pieces of paper which were gently placed in a coffin and carried around the crematorium three times. They then conducted the ritual. The ritual was also to show the public that the Buddhist temple was now cleansed of the sins and no evil spirits are menacing the open site. As some people believe, the revengeful spirit of an aborted fetus is especially dangerous because it lingers to hunt the mother and others who helped kill the unborn baby. It is also unclear whether the corpses were intended to be made into commandos, as no official statement have been given. That is it for this episode of Forbidden Door. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again soon.